I got so drunk last night, I couldn't tell if I had my period or I was shitting blood. Hi, welcome to Tubbin' with Tosh. Our first guest is a great friend of mine. You're going to love her as much as I do. Please give it up for the hilarious, the glamorous, Miss Sarah Silverman. So honored to be here. Thank you so much for coming to my tub. Thank you for having me in your tub. Let me ask you some questions, do you mind? Anything. You've been in this business a long time. Mm, yeah, God. Where do you see my career in five years? Well, as you know, I think you're wildly talented. Thank you. And a good person. And I think you're really going to have a moment. Like, you've already had many successes. I see you having, like, a major moment. Covers of magazines, movies, and then it just, I feel like it's just going to be over. Huge moment, though. Quiet! Words are fucking cunts. How competitive are you? Like, would you say you're as competitive with me as, say, like, I am with Robin Williams? You're competitive with Robin Williams? I'm not. Oh, 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 Mindy. I don't feel that competitive with you. Although I do feel pretty competitive with people. Because there's only one slot. Either me or you. If the love of your life asked you to grow out your pubic hair and armpit hair, would you? Absolutely. I mean, first of all, it would take about 11 and a half hours. I'll tell you what I do and I just get used to it. I shave my undercarriage. Quick, 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 quick. Quick, 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 quick. What's your most embarrassing tampon story? I have a great tampon craft, if you have a tampon. I think Pick it's... bottom. Do you have any tampons? He always carries them. Oh, that's perfect. Wow. Just take it out of the container, that doesn't matter. And you find a hard surface and you just... <laughs> Look at that. That is beautiful. And so it will stay forever. Do you not want to have babies because of your career or because it'd be a mess? I love kids. You know I'm big. Your tampon is on my car. Oh, I'm sorry. We that were was doing me. a little game. Sorry, this is Bart Baggett. He's my neighbor. He's a handwriting analysis person. You are? It's true. Can I... we do handwriting analysis? Okay. Well, come inside. I've never analyzed handwriting in a hot tub before. Can you bring no. us something to write on? Something. Bart Baggett here is going like to. This? Can you erase your to do list? You wrote it down, mistress. I, I understand, but right now... Bart can... Baggett. I love your last name. <laughs> Pig bottom enough. Okay, I'll go. All right, so can you do our handwriting? Yeah. How do we do it? You just write the sentence, you and your silly monkey go home can to the zoo. Can you just do our names? The G's have the sex drive and the T's have the self-esteem. This is, actually, I had uh, written my name down and wanted to see if you could uh, analyze it. Is there any sort of obsessions or sort of areas that might oh yeah what does the g tell you you said g's tell you i'm seeing penises are you seeing penises not at all no it's just pig 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 bottom actually can decipher your personality by examining your shit on his chest you have to use cursive though so you have to scoot your butt a lot <laughs> while you write it thanks piggy well bart thanks for um joining us i'm glad i stopped by what a great time you know bart baggett <laughs> if you replaced the b's in his name with f's his name would be fart faggot Took the hand of a creature, man and whip, made love in the sun. But I ran out of places and friendly faces because I had to be free. Acting is about core strengthening. That's what you got. You got to do Pilates. You got to get a TRX band as soon as you move out here. This is a little warm up I do.